Hi, my name is Naomi Joseph and I'm the Church Minister at the Third Place in Milford Haven. Our aim here uh, as a church really is to reflect the heart of Jesus in our community. So um, we have a charity and we run a number of projects. Uh, for the last eight years we've been running a debt counselling service. We partner with a national charity called Christians Against Poverty and uh, provide help and get people out of debt uh, wherever they are in Pembrokeshire. Another thing that we like to do is um, help people who have got addictions and want support to get rid of habits that they're, they're not comfortable with. So we, we run a support group um, to help people manage those addictions and break free from them. We also partner with um, Pembrokeshire Domestic Abuse Support and uh, provide one-to-one -one counselling for ladies who are either victims or survivors of domestic violence locally. We have a wonderful church community here and uh, people are very keen to get involved and volunteer and help out where they can. And last year we opened a coffee shop to provide a space where people who are maybe isolated or just want conversation and build new friendships can come get a coffee and some home-baked cake and come and talk to meet other people in the local community. Quite timely with uh, what the whole country's been through in the last 12 months, um, but many more of us have been hugely isolated or maybe our mental health has been affected, so the coffee shop just provides somewhere where people can gather and feel a part of a wider community. The coffee shop is a great space as well where people can come and access other services and we partner with PATH, um, provide tenancy support for people locally or simple things like somewhere where you can actually come and get prayer. One of the issues that we really wanted to address uh, over 12 months ago was rough sleeping in Pembrokeshire and again we have a wonderful partnership with PATH and Pembrokeshire County Council and uh, we managed to get two specially built uh, emergency accommodation pods which are housed in the backyard here and can accommodate people who find themselves sleeping rough. This next 12 months we hope to move on from there. Uh, we've found that the need is uh, for further accommodation um, so we're partnering with a, another Christian national charity called Green Pastures and we aim hopefully by the end of this year to buy a house in Milford Haven where we can provide long-term accommodation for three or four people who currently don't have a home from which they can begin to rebuild their lives and start completely afresh. The heart of Jesus is justice and love and as a church that's what our aim is to try and reflect that in the community in which all of us uh, live and work together. My name is Nia, I'm an Advice and Bond caseworker at PATH. We are a registered charity that began our work in 1979 and have developed our services over the years to help all homeless or those at risk by providing advice, assistance and advocacy to help find secure, safe and affordable accommodation throughout Pembrokeshire. When a call comes through to our duty line, it is our opportunity to get an understanding of the client's current circumstance. For example, are they currently homeless or at risk? or are they sofa surfing, street homeless or roofless? Um, if they have nowhere to stay that night, this is when the pods are extremely valuable. We complete a housing needs assessment immediately to understand what help and service they require. At PATH, our vision is to end the cycle of homelessness we believe that no person should have to sleep rough and everyone should be treated with respect, honesty, dignity and without prejudice. These pods are just one small part of that vision. We also aim to provide the support that's needed to prevent homelessness in the long term through our supporting people services. We will make sure the client is maximising their income and has all the tools available to succeed with their future tenancies. Hi, my name's John and I'm an Advice and Bond Coordinator at PATH. The pods have been created in partnership with Pembrokeshire County Council in the third place. They're not seen as a long-term option, but they do provide shelter, warmth, a hot shower, warm meal, security and stability, 
which is something our clients are crying out for while they seek the help they need to address their housing situation. One of the key elements of this project is that the client actively engages with us to explore all housing options available to them. Making sure that they're on the local housing list, engaging with Pathway Lettings, our social letting agent, as well as exploring other avenues online, other estate agents, social media. This helps us maintain regular contact to discuss other options available to them and their next steps. Hi, my name is Steve. I'm a local Pembrokeshire County Councillor for one of the wards in Milford Haven. Um, i just like to say, seeing charities like The Third Place working together with people like um, PATH, Pembrokeshire County Council, is just wonderful. And something which addresses real issues in society at the moment, uh, i.e. homelessness, to be able to help in that and, and be involved in the initial idea through to fruition for myself is um, an enormous sense of, um, sense of pride. Thank you.